I have no idea what to expect with this. Just listen to this music. What? What? When you hear this, just tell me what you think the name of this game is that I'm about to play. Just tell me what you think it is. What? You read it already? The title of this video says exactly the name of the game. Well, you're still not prepared for baby labor. Yeah, that's it. That's right. That's the name of the game I'm playing. Never thought in a million years that I would play a game called Baby Labor, but here we are. Let's begin. Oh, <laughs> hello. I'm Baby Boy Jackson. I'm here for the job interview. All right, we always need new people. That's what I've heard. Uh, what are your special skills? What would make you happy? Why did you quit your previous job? I'm interested to know that. Let's hear what he has to say. I didn't feel challenged. It's like my work was done for me. Well, what are your special skills? I learn fast. <laughs> well, you are a baby. I learn a lot fast. They say babies' brains are like sponges, so I do believe that. What would make you happy? Dangling keys from expensive cars. <laughs> well, we all know how much babies like this. What is your biggest strength? I'm impossible to ignore. <laughs> what is your biggest weakness? I have a thing on the back of my head. My skull is squishy there. Okay. So this is quite literally a baby. A very big baby, mind you, but quite literally a baby. I'll be sure not to whack the back of your head with anything while we're working. Describe your dream job. Putting shapes into wrong places, destroying things, screaming. All right, well, that's two things we have in common. The putting shapes into wrong places things, I'm, I'm too big brained for that. But the other two, we're, we're, we're one and the same there. What is your leadership style? I've learned recently that if I scream loud, people do what I want. You know something? I may have to take that into consideration for my own life. Ah! What do you do outside of work? Just have fun until I vomit. Yep, you and me both. Why do you want this job? Please, something to do really. Okay, well that's not a good enough reason. Money is good too. That's a little bit better of a reason, I understand that. I'm in the same boat, that's the reason why I haven't quit my job yet, so. Where's your shirt? Yeah, you, you didn't ask for it in the in the ad oh okay <laughs> well you know typically when you go to a job interview you want to put a shirt on preferably a nice button-up shirt maybe a tie if you're really trying to go that extra mile but you know something man i like the cut of your jib i don't know what it is maybe it's the dark soulless eyes or maybe it's the fact that we need younger people in the office here so what are why are why are you t the best candidate i'm a white man <laughs> Out. <laughs> we'll call you back. My god, that, that went south, didn't it? Does that mean I got the job? I was told I'm the one by your HR. Well, we need to review your CV anyway. That's my response. Ah, I gotcha. Another formality. Yeah, okay. I don't know, man. I think uh, there's something weird about this guy. Hello? Baby boy Jackson. That's me. This is your performance review. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, yeah. Uh, sound more excited for the job. Excuse me? It's just a formality. No, 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 no. There's no formalities here. Listen, I'm the one making the decision here. You got to do what I say if you want the job. I don't know if I like this guy anymore. I don't know if I like him. You still don't wear a shirt. Doesn't say anywhere I can't. Actually, in clause C8, section 5, subsection 3, it says all employees must wear a shirt. This isn't, this is the back of a bag of flaming Hot Doritos. It's not a contract. It's common sense. Common sense isn't law. You know, you got a point there. I'll wear whatever I want. Can you stop screaming in the meetings? They're long. I, if I scream, they stop. <laughs> and we get to work. Oh, okay. All right. Well, thinking ahead a little bit then. But sometimes these meetings are a little bit necessary for us to kind of figure out what's gonna happen in the company next. And if we have a giant baby screaming the entire time, it doesn't really help us. You're making people do your work for you. The work gets done. 
<laughs> What's the difference? Who does it? We're paying you. I was literally going to say exactly what came up on the screen. We're paying you to do it. And I'm doing it. No, you're not doing it. No, you don't. Whatever. All right. Listen, man, this isn't going well. You keep forgetting everybody's name. I black out every night. I'm a baby. Maybe you had one too many glasses of milk. You gotta really calm it down with that, man. You have work the next day, all right? What do you plan to change in your attitude? Nothing. All right, you know something? I'll have to talk to HR. We're gonna have a nice long chat about you. Do what you want. Do you want this job or not? No. Are you quitting? No. <laughs> Okay, work with me here. Look, I don't know how to fix it. Can I hear your plan? Do you have a plan? You'll just have to trust me. I'm skeptical, man. You haven't given me enough reason. I don't know what is going on. I am the head of HR. You demanded to see me. Yes, Mr. Johnson. What's this about? <clears throat> it's about baby boy Jackson. His numbers look really good. I don't see what's the issue here. He doesn't wear a shirt. I don't believe it's a law, and he looks good without it. Clearly works out. <laughs> he makes people pick him up. I don't see a problem. Co-workers should help each other. Some people are uncomfortable with it, sir. We're one team. They have to be team players. The screaming is an issue as well. It's passion. <laughs> oh, dude, I love this. Passion is good. You can show it quietly. We can't police anybody's passion. He hasn't done a single task himself though. I can't believe it. His numbers tell a different story. He takes all the credit. He's making everybody else do the things and he takes all the credit for it. Do you have witnesses? People are scared to come forward because they know baby boy Jackson is gonna beat the ever loving f I'll be honest with you. I knew this was the case. This is just your word against his. I've been here for 15 years. Correct. So you believe me? I think you're stuck in your ways. You're just saying that because he's a baby and so are you. Maybe you should open up a baby. I don't think he's right for the job, sir. I picked Jackson myself. That's why he was the only candidate? And because he looks exactly like you? Are you brothers or something? Is this nepotism? Indeed. <laughs> well, I, I, he was answering the other, but whatever. Perhaps you're right. Maybe he's not right for this position. We'll review it internally. Your complaint will be taken into account. That's all I'm asking, Mr. Johnson. All right, so what's gonna come of this? Baby boy Jackson, hello? Sir, how did I do with your office? It's exactly the same. Oh, wait, yes, it looks good. It's shit! I don't like you, man. Noted. <laughs> okay, that's wonderful. Let's talk about your performance. You ignore the no shirt policy. It's not the law. It is the law now. It's wrong. Questions, superiors. Noted. Wow, okay. Your numbers are quite low. Your quota is impossible. I took care of it. Okay, when I was in your position. Oh, that's what you're saying. You took care of it when I, when. So, okay, so the baby that I hired is now my superior. You made other people do it. Everybody else does it. And we have hundreds of interns quitting because you suck. They're interns. Expendable. Oh, that's how you feel. This is a family, man. This isn't just a job. I just don't see you passion because I don't raise my voice. Scream. <laughs> Screaming is how we do things. We've been civilized for 16 years. Are you calling me a brute? Yes, sir. I guess you don't want this job. Of course, I got demoted. We felt this was appropriate. Now, would you like to pick me up? Pardon? Pick me up. Um make my decision simpler. I won't pick you up, man. I'm not doing it. I don't feel comfortable doing that. I don't think you care about your career. What does it have to do with picking you up? You need to be a team player. We help each other out. Listen, guy, I won't pick you up. I'll make a note of this. Fine, do it. That would be all. I have no idea what's going on here, man. Oh, hey, I'm back here. Asshole, address me properly. I'm gonna get fired. That's my next goal here. Baby boy, yeah. I'd appreciate it if you address me properly. Boss, company is going through changes. We're growing rapidly. So many people are left behind. You're one of those people. <laughs> oh God, you don't have what it takes. Competition is hard. I'm not picking you up, man. 
You, you could forget about it. It's not happening. That's not what it's about. So I'm fired. Please, please. Yes! Oh, yes! Do I have anything to say? No, I'm out of here. Take it easy. Bye-bye. What the f- Trader, you're done, baby boy Jackson. I am complete. Oh, oh my god. The people deny your godhood. The ascension is final? The revolution is here to take you down. What just what happened? You're dead, motherfucker. Salvation. Repent and we let you live. Mercy. What have you done? Oh, god. See, this is why I can't work for anyone else. You know, things just don't go the way I want. I, I always end up feeling taken advantage of and then the boss becomes a demigod baby glowing in galactic form taking over the earth. Don't you hate it when that happens? <laughs> what the hell did I just play, dude? That was Baby Labor. That might be one of the strangest games I've ever played in my life and I liked it. I'm a big fan of like weird surreal stuff, so this really fit into that niche. There's definitely a lot of comedy going on here, which is another thing I'm into. And a riveting story, a coming of age tale, a tale of triumph, determination, and pooping in diapers. This is pretty good, I enjoyed this. If you guys wanna try this out for yourselves, I'll leave a link down below in the description for you. But that's gonna be it from here today. Thanks everyone so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button down below if you did, and don't be afraid to leave me a comment as well. And if you like what I'm doing on this channel and you wanna catch a new video every single day of the week, I would love it if you hit that subscribe button for me. Thanks again for watching everyone, and I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Take it easy.